The beauty of summer may be fading, but the fall will be exciting. Hi, I'm Reverend Tom Kearns. Welcome to 333 Magic 9, your astrology channel. There's lots of exciting aspects coming, and here's what they mean for your sign. Venus and Mars are conjunct, and they both trine Pluto from the 1st through the 5th. Libra, the month begins as Pluto in the fourth house of foundations trines Venus and Mars traveling together in your twelfth house of limitations. Now, this brings a gentle but powerful energy to your dreams and visions. Clarify what you value and what you desire so you know what you need. Impulses receive extra guidance. Now, Pluto's trying from the fourth house of the emotional foundations brings a deep psychological cleansing. Use this force to honor your fears by facing them. You'll gain a deep sense of spiritual security and power. Jupiter enters Scorpio for the first time in 12 years. Libra, Jupiter enters Scorpio for the first time in 12 years and transits your second house of resources. He brings opportunities to increase your sense of value in the world. You may gain through investments or hard work, and you will realize the real power of money. You would be wise to improve your personal talents and your abilities, for they are your greatest personal assets. Mars squares Saturn on October 11th. Libra, Mars in your 12th house of limitations, increases your need to understand your hidden fears and desires. Now, you must know your true motivations, or you might wind up getting things that you don't really want. <laughs> so keep your emotions clear. The square to Saturn in the third house of the mind warned you to use caution in communications and travel. Use any delays to enhance your personal talents and abilities so you can be more successful. The new moon opposes Uranus on October 19th. Libra, the new moon in your seventh house of partners, opposite Uranus in your first house of projection, suggests that balance must be maintained between your needs and partner's needs. Remember the seven-year itch? Don't get there. Uranus creates this effect. Listen carefully to others and negotiate a middle ground when necessary. Willfulness must be replaced with flexibility and understanding. This is a good time for you to honor your talents and the talents and ideas of others. Watch your reputation in public situations don't be too crazy. Bountiful Jupiter conjuncts the Sun on the 26th, but sultry Venus squares Pluto on the 27th. Libra, the powerful Sun-Jupiter conjunction energizes your second house of resources, increasing your potential for making Aha! Uh -huh. And spending money. <laughs> this is a time for wise investments and perhaps even a small gamble on a quality investment. Listen to your intuition, but not your greed, <laughs> as clarity of mind will guide you. The Venus-Pluto square creates a conflict you must manage by blending outward expression and your inner emotional need for security in a productive manner. This enhances your sense of identity and builds a powerful inner foundation. I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to thank you for listening. Please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends because it's free. And if you'd like to know more about your own astrology chart, just go to my website, professorastrology.com, and there you can register for a chart for a natal or birth chart. All you need is your time, date, and place of birth, and all the information is on 
my private readings page. So again, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope you'll subscribe and have a great month.